From the University of North Dakota, I'm Justin Storm and thank you for joining me for this special weather update. We have a winter storm working its way into our area which will be affecting us Wednesday early morning throughout Wednesday afternoon. This will bring near blizzard conditions with blowing snow and strong winds and on the back side of it some pretty cold temperatures. We'll talk about those snow totals, a little bit about traveling conditions and those temperatures to come going into Wednesday night and Thursday morning. Right now, winds around 20 to 25 miles per hour blowing into the Red River Valley. These strong winds will bring a little bit of warmer temperatures up from southern Minnesota up to the Red River Valley where we could see temperatures in those upper 30s today. But as we take a look at our satellite radar, we can see our next low pressure system out in Montana. This is our winter storm which will be working its way in towards our area going into the night. Right now, a little bit of snow affecting eastern Minnesota and central Minnesota and just recently a little bit of mixed precip or frozen precip going through parts of Grand Forks and just to the east of Grand Forks. Jumping into our future cast, our low pressure system here, our winter storm, it's gonna work its way into the area. We could be looking at a little bit of mixed precip and snow starting between midnight and three o'clock in the morning overnight tonight. As we go into tomorrow morning, that snow affecting most of Minnesota, the southeastern part of North Dakota, and most of South Dakota as well. And going through the afternoon, that snow persisting throughout Minnesota before eventually working its way out towards the Northern Great Lakes going into Thursday morning. Snow totals not looking extremely impressive, especially throughout the North Dakota region. One to three inches of snow expected through Grand Forks and Fargo of the Red River Valley. We will be looking at around three to four inches or, or two to four inches of snow throughout much of Minnesota and then four to eight as we work our way in towards the northeastern part of Minnesota. Closer into the central part of Minnesota, likelihood of being closer to four inches of snow as the system works its way through and then gradually increasing as we head our way into northeastern Minnesota towards Duluth. Now with this snow total and the winds, we are gonna have winds going around 30 miles per hour on the backside of this low pressure system, which will bring near whiteout conditions going through Wednesday morning and Wednesday afternoon with a lot of blowing snow. This wind will persist throughout Wednesday afternoon, which will drastically affect traveling conditions to possibly near impossible throughout parts of the area, especially rural Red River Valley area in northern Minnesota with near whiteout conditions. Those roadways will be extremely slick. Future wind gust potentials show possible gusts up to 50 miles per hour, which is just gonna add to that blowing snow, making traveling very difficult throughout much of this region of western Minnesota and eastern North Dakota. And those wind gusts will continue up to 40 miles per hour through Wednesday afternoon and into Thursday morning. Now the National Weather Service has issued a winter storm watch in effect until midnight tomorrow. It's likely that this will turn into a winter storm warning tonight. We possibly could see blizzard warnings with near blizzard conditions throughout the northern part of Minnesota and eastern North Dakota. But right now, a winter storm watch in effect until midnight tomorrow. On the backside of our low pressure system, we're going to have some cold Arctic air working its way into the region Wednesday into Wednesday night, especially affecting us Thursday morning. We'll see temperatures tomorrow morning close to zero throughout the northern part of our viewing area. And on the backside, again, this cold air just being pushed down going through Wednesday night into Thursday morning. Temperatures as low as negative 20 degrees, negative double digits throughout much of northern Minnesota as they stretch into central Minnesota. Uh, these winds with this is going to be bringing some pretty drastic windshields as well. As we take a look at that, with these temperatures and that winds, we could be looking at windshield values as low as negative 40 degrees going into Thursday morning. But throughout Wednesday afternoon, temperatures around negative 20 to negative 30 with those windshield values, and those will gradually increase into the northern part of Minnesota throughout Thursday morning. From the University of North Dakota, I'm Justin Storm, and this has been your special weather update.